We are the keepers of the flame, the sacred order. Let the ceremony begin. And today, faithful acolytes, we take a look at this. And what this is, is I think a seasonal sauce from Lay's called Hot Sauce Flavored. And it, even though I didn't notice this until after I got Frank's Red Hot, which is a uh, definitely a misnomer. There's nothing hot about it, although it is definitely a red sauce. A uh, cayenne sauce and I, I felt that I couldn't not get this given how much the blog which is available in the description below and the video series of the fundamentals of heat spends so much time on hot sauce I couldn't I couldn't not get this if that makes any sense uh, it is cayenne cayenne is the sole pepper in this thing so we're not expecting any kind of heat at all. And we have a meet the smile. I think this this part I think is really cool. This whole meet the smile business right here. It, apparently it's a guy on the front and it's Coach Kali, the downtown boxing gym in Detroit. And very, 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 very cool. So good, good, this is a good thing here. I don't know why they've chosen this individual for these uh, and other people for some of the other ones that they're doing. I'm not sure, but uh, just a very cool little side story there. And I like that they're doing that. Okay, so we might as well just get into this right now. And there we go. So about what we would expect, we'd expect a very light reddish coloration to some of these here. Let's, let's take a look at them close up. I am not... You know, these, these don't look radically different from plain potato chips, if I'm being honest here. This one has a fairly heavy concentration, but most of them don't seem to. It does smell, uh, it does smell somewhat like Frank's, though. You know, and of course, Frank's is the company that we all know from Frank's will put that it's either shit or sauce on everything depending on how you choose to look at it I'm assuming they're being put put that sauce and everything but presumably you wouldn't want to put shit on everything I guess hopefully hopefully you wouldn't but uh, all right let's get into this and see how worthwhile if at all these are So, first flavor I'm getting is vinegar. This is um, Frank's Red Hot Seasoning, so it's a Red Hot Sauce Powder apparently. If you like Frank's, you'll probably like these. I personally am not a fan of that. If it's the only thing there, I'll use it. It's a very pedestrian sauce to me. And I suspect in a lot of ways that's really why it took off as much as it has. I 
I mean, you got Texas P, which is, in my view, a tastier version of this. But very similar, ultimately. No real heat here. I mean, I'll give it a default one because there's enough here that to notice, I guess, but it's definitely not even approaching even close to a legit one. I'll make a few more of these to see if I get any kind of build. I should say to be see if I'll be surprised by any kind of build. I've had hotter Cheetos. Those, those cheese jalapeno Cheetos are hotter than this is. I guess you could say the Red Hots arguably are also. These are just, honestly, these are just okay. They're a little bit more vaguely reminiscent of, of a buffalo style chip that you might see. Just without the blue cheese or, or ranch or whatever dipping sauce component. I don't know where they're marking this, these chips. I'm really baffled by this. I like their seasonal things where they come out with all the fancy flavors once or twice a year. This one, I honestly think you kind of need to combine with something else. It is a good, um, not too filthy here, it is a good representation of Frank's. Which is a very pedestrian, run-of-the-mill sauce called the Budweiser of hot sauces, I guess. Or the Miller Light of Sauces, I suppose, something like that, where it's just a run of the mill, somewhat tasteless, kind of bland sauce that is basically just one step above nothing. So, chips are a good representation of that. Uh, I would never buy these again, and I think, I think I'll probably finish out the bag, but these are not an interesting snack in any type of form so I also might not but yeah there you have it the Lay's hot sauce flavored with Frank's red hot stylings again your mileage is going to vary if you like Frank's you'll probably like these I'm not a big fan of Frank's but I couldn't not get a chip that was calling itself hot sauce flavored so that's largely why I have these, but there you go. Now go forth in peace to serve the flame.